Well, everybody, now it's time to start my two lawnmowers. I have my Honda HRM 215, which is my oldest, because it says it's a 1995 on the engine specs on the side of the engine cover. And my lovely one, my 2003 lawnmower 1023, which would be the last one to start. Alright, so we're going to start the Honda HRM 215 first, and then the lawnmower 1023 is last. Okay, so the Honda is on two that sent horn. This engine is a um this is a HRM 215, I think it's called the S Etso, which has uh which doesn't have blade stop. This one has a two-speed transmission for the self pill wheel wheel drive system. And you see it's HRM 215. This engine right here you can see it says a special 135 CM. So it's a 135cc engine, and uh, this engine is called the Honda GXB uh, 140. This is the GXB 140 engine. It's a good engine. All right. So before we start, let's check the oil. It's no really need an oil change. Maybe soon. I don't use it as much because the transmission. Oh yeah, it's fine. I mean, you can see the marks. And I put some gas in it, and the same thing on my lawn boy. And let's do it. Alright, let's go ahead and start this up. The deck is uh, made of plastic. Alright, turn on. This is a throttle, so that's slow. This is still slow. This is fast. And they're all the way down this choke. I'm in the clamp, that's what I meant. Okay, so fuel valve is on. It's on choke. done now last but not least the long boy turn three two three now I definitely know anything of course I do know a lot um, about this mower this is a 6.5 horsepower two-stroke dual force engine one of my favorite sounding engines on world pie mower and it's also most powerful so yeah, this is my very first lawn I bought, and um, you have probably have seen it in my uh, last time of my course video of 2019. So yeah, in uh, December 2019, January 2020, I did some spray painting of this thing. As uh, you can see here, I did this, and I also did more of this part. Two, there's a bit rest of there, but after fix that. Uh, I accidentally got uh, my lawn boy spray paint on here around the engine and the spark plug wire and around the shroud. I am annoying because I forgot I could put tape on it because I tilted to the other side. Guys, if you look underneath, 
Oh yeah. That is even a C. I spoke painted by under deck, not the lawn boy paint. I used um uh I used rust oleum gloss spring green. So yeah, as you can see I had on this spray paint at this point, some of the areas have wrinkled, but at least I used sandpaper to sand that off and I think this was the most important part. And I also fixed um back here a bit and then yeah. I had to only spray painted the high turns at the edges up right there. High changes up there. I had to only spray paint that and that's put that and it'd be awesome. Yeah, alright. Now I put some 32 to 1 gas oil in here. And I have my number 650 on there, which you have seen in my video. I put that on there because my favorite supercar, which is a Ferrari Enzo, has to turn 50 horsepower, and this is 6.5 horsepower, so that's why I put it on there. It's not, it's kind of my fleet number, but I just put it on the front. Alright, let's apply them a couple of times. There is plenty. Put on choke. Alright, start for a second pull. Here we go. Still had three poles, but wasn't bad. Actually, did surge a little, but man, once it stopped surging, this thing really runs real good. All right, guys, so that is it. That is the video of giving my trimmers, blowers, and lawnmowers for 2020. They all started fantastic, except my Echo PV200, which didn't want to start because it's amateur has a broken start rope. So yeah, so hopefully you guys um, enjoy this video and um, maybe next time I'm going to wait until this grass grows. I will make a video before the grass grows. That may be a long equipment tour video or I'll do um, another trimmer blower review. I never know any trimmer reviews, but I kind of want to. Alright, so hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.